feels like I've known you girl all my life when I'm with you. No Good morning! We are officially in the Bahamas. We are in Nassau Bahamas today guys. Today is day five. So we are out here. I'm so excited. It is a beautiful day outside. It's actually a little cool. It's not hot. I thought it was going to be really really hot out here but it's actually maybe it's because we're like maybe the breeze. I'm not quite sure but it looks pretty beautiful outside. It's a gorgeous day. I'm going to show you guys. We're actually in front of a carnival cruise. Oh, the Carnival Pride. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know, guys. I, I think I have, like, a... I have a sore throat. I woke up with a sore throat. I'm just going to pretend that I'm not going to get sick. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It happens. Sometimes, like, I feel like whenever I have really bad allergies, it comes followed up with a nice cold. I'm not excited for that. But anyways, so I'm going to show you guys my view from our room and then we're going to head out of here guys because we gotta have a lot of things to do. It's currently 1020 in the morning. We got to get going. We got to go, go, go. So um, yeah, look at these views guys. This is currently our balcony view. Like I said, there's a carnival cruise ship in front of us. But that is a view. They're doing some cleaning apparently. But this is the view from the from our balcony and then that is the port that we're going to be walking down. Uh, so, so, so excited. Tomorrow we have another fun um, day plan. We're going to be at um, Royal's private um, island tomorrow. It's called Coco Cay and we're going to be adventuring, doing some fun stuff tomorrow too. And then we're back home. So there's only two more days left of vacation. Ah! I don't want to go back, but at the same time, I miss our, our fur baby, so I'm kind of glad that the vacation is almost over, but sad because vacation is almost over. <laughs> so, um, yeah, Seth is currently getting ready, so as soon as we're done, we're going to check back in, do some fit checks, and then we're going to get into some fun excursions. I don't know what we have planned. We didn't actually book anything um, for today because we kind of just said we can get ourselves into maybe some, like, bar hopping, if you will, or, like, I don't know, something. So... <laughs> Let's get into it. Are you excited? Yes, I am. <laughs> Are you excited? I'm super excited. I can't wait to get off the boat. <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> so somebody was in charge of the excursions again, and we got my TV. Oh, we are ready to go. We found this and then there's a little tiki uh, bar as well, so we're gonna get ourselves into something. 100 percent Yeah. The water's beautiful. Yeah, oh my god, let me show you guys the water real quick because it is stunning. I think Steph and I are probably gonna head to the beach in a little bit. Look at that water guys. Uh that's definitely not Florida water. Yeah. Not at all. I think we're probably gonna get uh, something to drink. We're probably gonna do two two more stops, and then we're gonna head to the beach. I think, right? Okay. Yeah. Or yeah. Do some. Yeah. Yeah. So let's get some drinks. What's, What's up, squad? squad? I'm Steph. And I'm Stephanie. Welcome back to the channel, guys. That's right back again with another fire video. <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Before you get into anything, please make sure you smash that like button, subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. Make sure you turn the post notification bell on. Boom. Lit in this thing. <laughs> Bahamian lit. We're lit in the Bahamas. We're lit in the Bahamas, baby. Oh, we should have brought our microphones. Dang, Dang we could have been talking, baby. We could have been ATV trash talking. You know what I'm saying? That's what it is when you're riding and you're just talking. You know, we were being honked at, all kind, all kind of mess. It was so good. <laughs> Steph did so good, guys. Uh, she had to, she had to drive on the left side of the road. She did so good. Yeah, yeah. I, I did all right parking though. The guy was like, "You want me to park it?" I was like, "No, nah, I got it." Yeah, yeah. I did it too. You did. Yeah. You sure did. You sure. Yeah, he was tripping about it, but I had it. Absolutely. Let's go. 
parking in what we think is like a regular parking lot but we're actually we might move depending i'm waiting on stuff to come back but um we're going to the fish fry i'm excited so as you guys know we are on our vegan journey um but if you're in the bahamas you kind of have to do fish so i'm excited to try it i think it'd be very very good and plus obviously we're by the ocean so and it's gonna be fried so i'm excited but i oh i i people wife i people wife how you doing i talked to security she said i'm good even better security said we're good this way to the left baby no it's the yellow building the massive yellow building how's your adventure going so far Oh, good. Yours? Yeah, I love it. It's so much fun. Yeah. I gotta reapply that sunscreen, boy. That sun is Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sun is so it's different. It's different than the US sun, let me tell you. Hi, how are you? Hi, no food today. Oh, oh we're, headed, we're headed to the food. <laughs> yeah. So they're all fish fry? Yeah, fish fry is not a restaurant. Oh. Oh my god, Stephanie is like on fire. Oh my gosh, it's so burnt. Mm. Oh no. Guys, we had to reapply sunscreen because this heat is ridiculous. Like, look at my whole face. My whole also, face is burnt. Fish fry guys almost fought over. Yeah. I had to, like, figure out which, well, Steph figured out which one to go, so I just followed suit. One was talking to me, one was talking to her. I was just like, oh, gotta go. Bye. It was very awkward. Um, but we finally found the place that we wanted to go to. Um, so we are about to eat some conch. I'm gonna do a conch burger. So it has. A tenderized Bahamian conch battered in fried golden crisp, dressed with tartar sauce, lettuce, tomatoes, and onion on a bun. Yeah, so guys, um, I know we've been doing the vegan thing, but Seventy and I had already agreed that pretty much because of been suffering on the boat, um, off the boat, we're just gonna do fish. We're not doing, yeah. um, we're still not doing like milk, eggs, or any of that stuff, but honestly, we need the protein and we haven't been getting it. Yeah. And I don't wanna be like, Starving. I don't want to say malnourished, but yeah. it's like there's not, it's not about that if you're vegan, you're malnourished because that's not the case. And I no, don't no, want no, that no. to be the narrative. It's just the fact that the boat doesn't supply enough protein for vegans. Like, yeah. the little chickpea stuff is like this little bit. A um, little bit of oh tofu. God, it's, super brown. <laughs> it's like a very small amount of tofu. Yeah, very small amount. Like, it's like, can't, can't honestly. It's not like enough protein lot. for us, honestly. It's a lot. And I've been working out and stuff every day. Yeah. So. And we've been drinking, and again, we're on yeah. vacation, so it's a little bit different, you know? Like, when you're on vacation, you're drinking the kind of, like, substance in your stomach. So, if yeah. we're lacking protein, it's like, for me, I, I, I can only speak for myself, but I feel like I get drunk faster. Um, so, definitely need some substance in our no, stomach. we definitely need some, some protein. It's like, I wish they had, like, better vegan options on the ship, yeah. and they don't. And so, we're pretty disappointed about that, but... We can only work with what we have. I'm not about to complain. I'm not gonna do Eat some conch. Get some grilled salmon. We're about to get some grilled salmon and I'm about to get some conch. Yeah, it's fishy. It's, it's a fish day, let me yeah. tell you. So, yeah, we're gonna have that and then we're gonna show you guys exactly what we ordered. But All I'm right, excited. I'm some sunscreen on you. Okay. <laughs> Watch my brows. Thank you. <laughs> she getting brown as shit. <laughs> oh. She about to look like me in a minute. <laughs> red as hell. You know, once you red, you the next day the next day is just brown. Right. <laughs> so when we got our ATVs, the lady that was so lovely, she told us to try the sky juice when we hit the uh, fish fry area. So it is literally just gin and coconut water. She said. Or coconut milk. Yeah. No, coconut water. Oh yes, 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 yes. It's just dark. It is dark. But that's actually how your coconut water yeah. is supposed to look. <laughs> you excited? They should put my trial in it. No, no. <laughs> Ooh, that's strong and good. Mm. That's good. Our, our tour or she wasn't our tour guide, but the one that set us up with the ATV, she said that she's going to be drinking a few of these tomorrow on her day off. Yeah. I was like, okay. She said, Today was my day off. I didn't get to go. So she, so she said, so she said she's gonna go. Um, she's gonna go tomorrow because tomorrow's another one of her day off. So yeah. She said she about to get lit. She get too much stuff to do. She said she had laundry. I mean, she told us everything. She told her whole life. Bro, I look like a brown biscuit. I don't care. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank you.
us here to the fish park. Yes. Yeah. She told us exactly where to go. There's one more place that I want to go before we hit the beach, but honestly, the beach is right here. You don't so. want to do the other beach area that she said? What was the other beach area? What was it called? Lockett? Lockett? Lockhart? I don't know. I, have to, I think it starts with an L, but I'm going to look it up right now. Yeah. The good thing is our GPS works here, so that's how we were able to get to the fish fry. And then that's um, also how we were able to get to see your frogs. Because yeah. I, I, we were able to do the GPS. So we're going to try the other. So I really want to go to Queen's um, oh. Staircase. Yeah, okay. So we're going to do Queen's Staircase. And then Zebby um, was like, beach, beach, beach. But I want to do Queen's Staircase because we've been talking about it like for two weeks. So we're yeah. going to do that. And then we'll do, if we still have time, then we'll do the other beach area. Yeah. We'll do that. Yeah. Because um, if you guys watched our... I want to say our last cruise, was that our last cruise? No, our first cruise together, we, um, if you guys watched that vlog, we did another type of staircase. It was called like, what, a thousand? A thousand steps. That was in yeah. St. Thomas. St. Thomas. And it was beautiful. The view over words is just gorgeous. And this one, it actually has um, a back, well, both of them have a backstory to it, but this one has like a, a bigger backstory to it. And I think, I think I don't know if it's bigger. They're just different. Yes. I won't say that because, you know, I don't want to disrespect, but, yeah. but they are different. But this yeah. one has another, but, you know, we like touristy stuff. Yeah. We like to see things and um, we read about stuff mm -hmm. and we try to do research to understand and you know that's why we want to know you know like you know what's the national you know uh, uh, room here we just you know yeah. we ask a lot of questions we read a lot of stuff so yeah we do our research before we be slightly to. nerdy when we need to be but you know so that's why she wants to do a thousand yeah stuff. I think it's gonna be really pretty and really cute so I, I think it'd be a great photo area for us and then also it's just gonna be really good for the vlog as well so you guys can come along and see but I'm really excited for this talk for her. You guys have no idea. When the lady was telling us about it, I was like, yes, I need one of those. Maybe two. <laughs> All right, so we have some fried conch here. We got some cocktail sauce and then some actual dairy sauce. This is probably what you used to. Oh, yeah, no, I don't I want that. These are all the variations that we have. All right, super. Still one hotter. Which, one, bring for the which one's the hottest? Oh, yeah? yeah? All right, cool. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Ooh, Steph is about to kill it with the hot sauce. Are you excited for the hot sauce? Yeah, I am. <laughs> oh, it's hot. Oh. That's hot. Ooh. Guys, this smells amazing. I wish you guys could be able to smell this because it's so good. Let's put the cocktail sauce on my side. Ooh, it's hot. Not the cocktail sauce on my side. You know dang well I ain't trying none of the other sauce. of our food came but honestly we just went at it um steph got her salmon it is fantastic it literally has basically no like spice or anything like seasoning if you will it's perfect it's absolutely it's like perfect. Salt and pepper is all. yeah i had my conch burger basically gone i can't fit anything else in my life i'm gonna try to fit this uh my little in in somehow but geez i, I don't even know how i'm gonna do that how are you feeling i have a 
great. <laughs> I feel like a king. Oh yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna finish this out and then get back on the ATVs so we can head out. It's 124 now. We have to be back to excuse me. We have to be back to the ATV place by three. So we gotta move a little fast. Oh, the food was fantastic. Bahamas, your food is just um, so we're about to get on the ATV and head out to the Queen's Staircase and then possibly the beach. Um, it's 1.43, we have to be back at the um, ATV place by 3, so we might, we might not hit the beach. It's okay because tomorrow we hit the beach, so I don't know. Might get ourselves into maybe one more thing after the Queen's uh, Staircase, but... I don't know. I'm, I'm super excited. I can't wait to see what's the next stop <laughs> after the Queen's Staircase because that's, that's the next stop. But after that, I don't know what we're going to get into. So we're about to head into the Queen's Staircase really quick and see everything. It's a few steps. It's a lot of steps actually. But I really wanted to get a few pictures up there. Let's go. Taking all the steps today, guys. Yeah, no, good thing I wore my Apple Watch. Ooh, good thing it's not day today, boy. Ooh, you would have cried yesterday. Yeah, I know. Yesterday. Oh, guys, this Bahamian sun is no joke. He said a canyon. A canyon, yeah. I think that's what he said. Yeah. To be honest, I can't. Rem I can't remember at no, all. No, this he is. Can't remember. Takes away your memory. Let me tell you. What my cooler just been canyon? Oh, okay, here, it explains everything, guys. Named for Queen Victoria, who became Queen of the United Kingdom in 1836. Oh, I'll let you guys pause and read. <laughs> Not too long. Not too long. All right, let's go. I'm going to put this camera on me so you guys can see me sweat. Because camera this is going to be good. People go up those steps. First of all, this is so historic. Oh. Yeah. All right. All right. Ready? Let's do it. Let's do the staircase, guys. Come on. First of all, these little stairs. First of all, these are so tiny. Look. Let's continue going up the stairs. First of all, my whole foot does not fit on the step. I'm sweating. Second round of steps. Huh? Wait. Okay. We got one more step, or not one more step. Yeah. One last round of stairs. Whew. All right, guys, we officially made it up those stairs. I'm gonna show you guys how far we went, so just so you guys can see. So you guys saw how deep those stairs were. First of all, this heat is ridiculous. Two, maybe I shouldn't have that many shots. I had too many shots before I got here. Alright guys, we're gonna close out here. My voice is really starting to like, we hope you guys enjoyed this video. We had a blast in the Bahamas, guys. It was amazing. If you're from the Bahamas, go ahead and comment in the comment section right now. Some fire emojis because you guys were amazing. So great. Uh, yeah, I can't wait for tomorrow. Good morning. What's up, squad? Welcome back to the channel, guys. It's your girl, Stephanie. Welcome back to another fire video. Before we get into this video, guys, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. Subscribe to the channel. Hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on another video. Another vlog video. So today we are officially at Coco Cay. Coco Cay is the private island for Royal Caribbean. I don't know if it's for if they share it with anybody, but I'm pretty sure it's just for Royal Caribbean. So there's currently another boat. Literally, I'll show you guys outside. I had to close this again because you guys know sometimes I'll open this in the morning or I'll have it open by the time I like check in with you guys. But I had to close that because if I could see people, people could see in here, and I was like. I if I come out of the shower, I don't need peeping toms. With that being said, I um, I closed it. But I'm going to show you guys in just a second when I step out. There's another boat directly in front of me. And then also you can see that we're officially here. It is only 7.16 in the morning. We've been, well, Steph woke up at 6.30 because she had to go to the gym. So we literally, the boat lets out at 8 a.m. And we have tickets for this private island for like adults. And let me tell you, just because there's no kids doesn't mean that the adults won't go there fast. There are going to be like no chairs and we need chairs because one, it's going to be hot outside. Two, you always need chairs. Like you can, like if you need a break from the pool, you need to sit at the chair. You know, you get what I'm saying? Just a quick check in. Um, last night I was not feeling my best. 
Um, still today, I've, I don't know if you guys can hear, but I'm a little congested. Um, my nose is not as, like, congested as yesterday when I got back on the boat. When I got back on the boat, I was, like, I was sneezing, and my nose was dripping, all that stuff. So, not as bad, but my throat is on fire. If it wasn't for Steph constantly feeding me, well, no, she only fed me twice yesterday and then this morning she gave me more honey but i just take a good spoonful of honey and it coats my throat so i'm pretty like good it's not as scratchy but it's way better because sometimes i feel like when i go to just even breathe my throat is so dry so that's where i'm at with that i'm not feeling my best but i have another fit to kill today and y'all know if I got a fit to kill, I gotta, I gotta go. I gotta do it. And we have like a whole nother adventure and we have to entertain you guys. Like, you guys have to see this. Like, first of all, the new adult area of Royal Caribbean is brand new. So not a lot of people have gone. So we have to get it on camera. We have to get it on film. One, two, y'all came here for the video. You guys came here for the vlog. I'm not gonna tell you guys that I'm sick on the last day. Are you crazy? Even though I am. But I have to go. We, we have to go. Um... I don't know how long we're going to be out there. I might have to cut everything short. But I think we have to come back on the boat by like 3. If we get out there by like 8, we'll probably be back maybe like by 1. Um, depending. Depending. Because if that heat knocks me again like yesterday, whoo, gosh. Uh, the Bahamas was hot. But so great. But hot. Um, but yeah, let me show you guys the boat and you can also see the, the walkway to Coco Cay. You guys are going to be like, ah, if you've never been to Coco Cay, if you've never been on a cruise, this is one of the highlights as far as like, I love this area for Royal Caribbean. Like I said, it's their own private island where they have a huge water park. Look it up. But <laughs> they have a huge water park. They have different like, I like not islands, but different beach entrances so there's like if you guys saw last year when we went on a cruise we were um at the oasis area which is basically it's a swim up bar it's a pool and also there's like a dj inside the water it was dope this time it's a whole like portion of the island that's just for adults with the same concept so i'm excited for this it's gonna be really good apparently they did say that they have vegan options at the um so we eat on the island and it's all covered like if we have the drink package um, all the drinks are covered as well as you don't have to pay for food You just have to basically go out there with your sea pass card, which is the card that you use to it's basically like your identification on the boat Also your card to get into your room So as long as you have your sea pass card and they see that you have the drink package or obviously your Royal Caribbean You can eat for free and you can also drink for free um, If you don't have the drink package, obviously you still have to pay for your drinks, but your food is covered so with that being said, let me show you guys outside. It sounds like they're doing a whole bunch of stuff. But they haven't come on with the announcements yet saying that we could get off the boat. So that means I need to move my little butt because it's already 7.20 in the morning. And not my phone telling me that I left my AirPod, AirPod Max is there with a little Haitian woman. How am I supposed to say that? They're with my wife. Anyways, so... Let me show you guys outside. Do you see this? You can literally see into somebody's room. I can't do that. Like, I like to walk around sometimes with no clothes on. I can't be having that. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you guys. All right. Oh my God, it smells like fish out here. So gross out there. It smells like sewage. I don't know how to explain it, but it doesn't smell great. Um, and two, I was not expecting those people to be looking out their balcony right when I was panning to the left. Anywho, but that is a walkway. I can't really see the opening of Coco Cay because those people were literally standing with their heads outside the balcony, and that's where I saw it last time when I was um, out there this morning. So. It's okay because when you go out there, you're going to see the huge thing. Also, at 8 a.m., they're going to do the whole song. I would record it, but I don't want to get copyrighted. But anyways, in short, there's a song that says, It's a perfect day at Coco Cay. So, where else was I going with that? I got really distracted by those people on their balcony. I'm not going to lie. I was not expecting them right there. Um, but yeah, that's why I'm closing this bad boy. Because, like I said, when I get out the shower, I'm not expecting somebody to be, like, looking out. You know, and, like... The shower is 
right here and it's right there like I don't want to possibly come out of the shower and somebody's like oh hey hello <laughs> so um yeah <sighs> I'm trying to think of what else before I get into the shower cuz y'all I don't want to be late I want to make sure that I have um enough time to eat my breakfast too guys if you go on a cruise doesn't matter which cruise I think you can do this with all cruises but I mean correct me in the comment section but if you are on a cruise and you are getting off at a port I strongly suggest for you to order your breakfast and have it come to your room because guys this has literally saved Steph and I like at least 20 to 30 minutes of not being able to get off the boat because we literally eat in our room and then we head out everything else we either eat where we're at or when we come back we eat at the whichever restaurant or main dining however we would do it so that's literally cut out like at least I want to say 20 to 30 minutes because imagine we get dressed then we have to go to a location within the boat to eat we have to wait or look around or whatever eat our food and then go because um right now what is open would be a uh, wing jammer which is basically buffet style food so they put out a bunch of food obviously like a buffet and then you choose and then you sit down eat and then you know you go from there but sometimes there's a bunch of people so you have to wait in line sometimes for like a certain food or whatever they try to make as many stops as possible so like for example whatever you see on the left side you might see it on the right side or so on and so forth but it's like a huge circle within the place I think I'm pretty sure we showed you guys but um yeah so imagine that having to go upstairs all the way to the 11th floor to do that eat get yourself together and then come back down all the way to the to the first floor to get off and if you try to get an elevator when people are trying to get off good luck buddy good luck that's why we're trying to get out there early because if not man let me tell you those elevators get crazy and people are waiting for towels and stuff like that so because this is usually a port that everybody gets off at, obviously people with kids or whatever, like there's a lot of people that get off at this port because hence it's Coco K, the food is included, the drinks are included, why not get off at this island? And you don't have to stay the whole day. I don't know if you guys know that either. If you get off at a port, you can come back at any time. You don't have to come back exactly at the time that they say that the port is closing. So you should like basically like you can get off the boat for 25 minutes and come back. So that's cool too but um yeah like that that saves us so much so that is my tip for you if you are cruising and you have to get off on a port put that put a, a thing that you want breakfast and it's free it's well it's not free you paid for your own cruise but you get what I'm saying like it doesn't cost you to have um what is this called room room service so it doesn't cost you more to have room service so you get your breakfast in your room and then you're ready to go you can head out you can leave whenever you want you can eat how much you want you can not eat how much you want whatever like you can have everything tailored to you so you don't have to wait and go somewhere and do all these things so that is my tip I'm gonna get myself in the shower because I've been talking to you guys for like a while there I'm not quite sure how long but I've been talking so I'm gonna get in the shower and then I'm gonna check back in with you I'm also gonna see if I can tidy up a bit because tomorrow we are officially back home so tonight they're gonna set they're gonna give us the infamous uh, infamous um, they're like these little tickets that go on your luggage if you want them to take your luggage and you have to put your luggage outside so that's gonna come probably right when we get back on the boat so me I don't want to see it no but it is what it is man it is what it is so um yeah I'm gonna take a nice little warm shower not not hot because that's not good when you're sick but I'm gonna take a warm shower and get myself ready and then I'm gonna check back in with you guys but um Steph is still at the gym if you if you're shocked I'm not because Steph is always at the gym when it comes down to vacation because she's like I'm drinking I gotta work out <laughs> So, yeah, I'll check back in in a moment. Fine. They are not ready for this outfit. Ooh, ow. <laughs> We're officially going to Coco Cay. It's only 9.50 in the morning, guys, and we are headed out. We're already, I'm running a little slow today, so that's why. That's why we're a little late. <laughs> we're currently on the tram getting ready to go to the entrance of Coco Cay. Yeah, and if you guys already know, Coco Cay is Royal Caribbean's private island, so... We're ready to go! Move this train! Let's go! We're on our second tram. Tram 2. 
this one's gonna take us to the part of the island that we reserved to be at. Yeah. For adults only. For adults only. It's supposed to be a swim up bar, pool area. I think they said DJ up in that thing. So I'm ready to listen to some music. I wanna hear some soca. <laughs> For sure. Let's see. We're headed. Let's go. There's a whole nother area to this. Wow. This place is massive. Look at that. Little infinity pool. Photo shoot over. You get all ten. Thank you. Did my best. Oh my god. You probably got you guys already probably seen the photos, but y'all. And if you haven't, head over to 70's Instagram at splash of stuff underscore to go look at the photos there. Yeah. Bang it. The chef's kiss. Get you somebody who can take your photo because she said that. What if people can't take photos? Doesn't mean they suck. They don't suck, but try. Try your hardest. Don't listen to her, y'all. Y'all gonna end up singing. What What do you want to do now? Do you want to get something to eat? Do you want to go to the pool? Do you want to get something to drink? These are all my questions. Get, girl, if you don't take my Apple Watch off your wrist. You gave it to me. It's mine. Oh, okay. <laughs> Thank you. I keep the I, I keep the Apple Watch on me because whenever we go in the Close pool and stuff the thing like that. Up, Cause last time. Oh yeah. You left it open. As I will. A matter of fact, please. I will right now. Okay. We'll be oh. back. <laughs> What were you gonna say? I was gonna say that I, I was wearing my Apple Watch uh -huh. because mm -hmm. when we get in the water and stuff like that, I need to be able to tell the time. Yeah. So we can we get back on the boat. <laughs> we have our phones and water pouches, but yes. What? Just, you know. Uh -huh. I'll put it on waterproof. Water. Okay. We're gonna go eat. We're gonna go drink. We're gonna go party together. All right. Comment down below if you think we'll be swaying back to the boat right now. Comment down below. Swaying or all good. We found the pool. Now we gotta find, well, I found the bar. <laughs> last day and we're leaving the ship okay we're at port 
ready to go. We got our stuff pack. Um, well, our stuff that we're carrying is over here. Um, they have the luggage actual, um, like our check, check-in bags or whatever. Um, so we had to put those outside of our door last night at 10 a.m. I mean 10 p.m. Sorry. So we did that. Look at this, guys. I will go out there, but honestly, it's like it smells like ruggy, uh, muggy rain and port water. So, Stephanie's in the restroom now, finishing up getting ready for this morning. And then, I mean, we we out, we out. We're gonna get probably a snack before we leave. Maybe um, we had our protein shakes, or I had my protein shake this morning. She hasn't had your hers yet, but she will because I made it. And um, guys. But you know, vacation has been good to us. Vacation looks good on us. Um, you know, the skin glowing. No, not really. Um, the sun's been beating me down. But um, no, but it's cool. We're gonna go home. You know, get back to our normal routine. And you know, we're gonna get to it. We're still coming at it at you guys with a content. We're not gonna drop that again. Um, so make sure you guys are tuning in. Make sure you guys are showing us some love. Make sure you guys, you know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all rocking with us, you know, because we rocking with y'all. We appreciate you guys. We love you so much. Um, I'm going to close out right here because, like I said, we got to go. And I don't want to forget to close out, <laughs> to be honest. And um, I want to come at you guys with another video. So, like I said, please show some love. If you guys want to see more travel content, you want to see us go more places, please show uh, show some love. Comment down below some, some places that you want to see us go. And we'll obviously make sure to keep that in mind. All right, guys, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe. You know, we keep it lit, lit. No quit. Hey, we out. <laughs> make you go lovey-dovey. Your body on me. Make you go lovey-dovey.